Good morning. Well, today I'm going to Stafford. Why that's exciting? It's probably not exciting to everybody else, but that's actually the town where I used to live and work when I was in England. It's been a long time since I've been there. It's about 11 years and I'm pretty happy that I'm going there with Seagull Phil. We're going to go and have a look around the town and see what else is new, what's changed or what's actually the same from when I was there last. All right, so we're off to Stafford now and uh, we'll uh, show you around some of the town, see what we can remember. <laughs> this is Derry. We should show the residents the potholes of Manchester. As you can see, the, Man the Manchester potholes behind <laughs> us there. Um, the roads here is about as good as is, um, India. Welcome to the door. So the lolly shop is new, however this building here is the ancient high house. It's actually the tallest uh, wooden structure building in England. Uh, it's quite an old building. It actually was once occupied by Charles I and there's actually a room upstairs where you can go in and it's the very bedroom that was used by Charles I during the Civil War. So it's uh, quite a historical, uh, historically important building here in Stafford. And as you can see it sits right in amongst the main high street here in the town. Uh, this one over here to the side at the pub there, the Swan, is is an old pub that uh, we used to go to. The bar on everything. Wow. Although I do remember that joint. <laughs> the old spoons. And the subway. I totally remember that. Wimpy's gone. I'm devastated. Not only is Chicago is no longer existing, but the building that replaced it is gone and it's left here gutted. It's a shell. That's horrible. But you can even still see the old Chicago rock sign out the front. They've got it left here. We will see who we look. Thank you. 